my dear friends and welcome to our school. My name is Jessie Shio and I am so happy to learn with you today about things around us. When we learn, we learn to look, observe and name things we can see in our school and even around us every day. But first, what exactly are we looking for? Hmm. Did you say answers? Absolutely, you are correct. And you know that to find anything, you really have to look. That is what science is all about. Looking for answers in everything that is around us. When we look, we look closely and we begin to wonder and even ask questions. To be very good in science, you must first look closely at the things around you and you pay close attention to what is around you. Number two, you must ask questions about everything. For example, how does a small seed, a small may seed, go into a big plant that gives us crumbs of maize? How does an aircraft fly in the sky? This is what it means to be what? Curious. For you to know, you must first be curious. Asking questions helps us to understand things. And when you understand, we can use questions and science to solve all our problems. And not just our problems, we can use it to solve it at home, in our community, in our school, and even in the world. We are learning science so that we can do good things that helps us to make a world a better place. So today, let's begin by looking around us. Wherever you are, whatever you're doing, look around you, whether you are at home, outside, in school, and even in the markets, it is time to get curious. Let's start by looking at things around this room. I want you to tap or point at your screen, or you can say it out loud if you want. Tell me those things you can see around. I can see a chair, a phone, a table, a mat, a pen, a book, a cup, pencils and crayons. Great job. You just named so many objects. This is how we begin to observe and identify things. Let us move to the classroom. Can you name the things you can see in the classroom? Hmm. Let's name five objects we can see in this classroom. A board, books, ruler, crayons, you are doing so well. Now, can you take a look outside? Tell me what you see. Here's what we might be able to see when we look outside. Stones, sand, for playing or even for drawing. Balls. And you know some balls are made of plastic that are tied together. Friends playing and laughing. Say some of their names out loud, let them hear you. Now, mention these things together with me. Stone, sand, ball. Let's now visit the school farm or the garden. Here we can see a lot of things. Soil, this is where our plants grow. Maize, cassava, or even tomato. Bucket for watering our plants, even maybe your chicken or your goats, and they are walking around. You can also see cutlass or, or even stick for digging or for planting. Now say it with me soy, corn, chicken, oh, 
you are amazing. Today you've learned to look around you and even name those things you see in different places. Great job. You can now name things you see in a room or at home, in the classroom, at the playground, in the garden, or even in the farm. You can see that we do not always need a big school to learn. You can learn right here. You can learn anywhere and even everywhere. And always remember, we learn and grow to change our world. Thank you for joining me today. I am so proud of you. Bye, friends, and see you in our next adventure. Thank you. We are leaders.